What's good, YouTube? It's your girl, Kid, and I'm back with another bang. And in today's video, we about to go to the WNBA. We finna go to the WNBA with it today. We finna see what 2K got on this new WNBA mode that they brought with this next gen. And this video is pretty much gonna be like an introduction, a little creation video, introducing y'all to the brand new WNBA series that we're gonna be bringing on to the channel. So as you know, we already got the male version of the My Career going on the channel. So we had to come over here and see what 2K got going on for the ladies. 2K tried to show love for the ladies this time. So we're finna check it out. So make sure y'all stay tuned, like up the video, and subscribe to the channel if you are new, all right? <laughs> I'm honestly excited that 2K decided to add this into the game. Good looking out for the ladies out there, 2K. The builds, the build creator on here is just, these are all preset builds, so it's not like you can fully customize your player. But if you do want to fully customize a WNBA player, you know, you got to do it in the, um, like in the My League or in the creative player thing. I mean, the builds, the preset builds aren't bad, though. They, they are not that bad at all, though. As you can see, none of the <laughs> you don't get any driving dump. But yeah, like the more you play around with the weight and height and stuff, it does the exact same thing as the regular. My player builder affects the same stats. So everything looks pretty much the same. All the takeovers look the same, everything. Still get the primary and secondary. What should we go with? Right, let's do this first. The inner slasher in me, I always gotta pick that. I always gotta pick that. Yeah, this menu looks pretty clean, nice and clean. Okay. So this is how you can track your progress. So with this mode, you know, you can't use VC to upgrade your player. You can't buy your way out or anything like that. It's just basically the more you play, the more skill points and stuff that you earn to level up your player. Like you can see on the right hand side, different at different levels, you get to unlock something. Like, you see, for example, at level 5, you get to change the jersey number. At level 4, you unlock the jump shot creator and stuff like that. So, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. It gives you a reason to want to keep playing so you can make your player better and earn different things. That's a good thing. And this little features menu. I mean, everything right here pretty much looks the same as, like, the My League and stuff like that. And that's how you get to the W right there. You start off at a 75 overall. Okay, so these are the hairstyles. Not sure how many they added for the women.
And then what they just got all the guy hairstyles in here as well. So these are the hairstyles they got for the women this way. And then all the guy hairstyles are towards the end. I don't know which hair we're gonna go with. So here are all of the clothes that you can choose from to wear on the W online. And then, you know, as you progress and level up, you unlock more clothes and shoes. Overall, I'm very excited about this game mode, and I'm very excited about this series, introducing you guys to it on the channel. I had to go ahead and get this creation video, or this little introduction video out the way so you guys can see some content. Like, the next WNBA video is going to be some gameplay. You guys will be able to see how my first WNBA game actually went, so... And things like that. And of course, we're going to be hitting up the W, playing online and, you know, hooping out over there and cross some people up, you know, get some buckets over there. But overall, it's a pretty good mode. Like, I, I love the fact that you actually have to play it to level up. Like, you're not going to buy your way to 99 and things like that. And it's not hard at all to level up your player. You level up pretty quickly. Um, it starts you off with badges automatically based off your build. And then... After every game or whatever, based on how you play, you earn more badges and you earn, you know, skill points and your overall and stuff goes up based on how you play after every game. The more you level up and things like that. So that's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. It's a pretty cool feature.